What's going on guys? My name is Marcel Flores. Welcome to my YouTube channel, One Dapper Street, and welcome to another What I Wore This Week video where I walk you through seven outfits that I put together over the past seven days. And today we're getting started with a pair of Uniqlo chinos in a green color for outfit number one. Up top we have from Zara a really nice knit t-shirt. Feels ultra stretchy, ultra soft, and it works perfectly in terms of color with these beautiful coach high top leather sneakers. I love those, haven't worn them in a really long time. On top of that, we're layering two pieces from The Gap. Um, number one, this linen shirt in a faded green, just a bit brighter than the chinos. And on top of that, a quarter zip sweatshirt with a pocket on the left chest. In terms of jewelry, we got a snake ring that has a little bit of green, a beaded bracelet, and then another silver ring and a feather bracelet for an overall nice monochromatic look in green, just a little bit of cream to get like an earth tone vibe going for the whole outfit. If that's too hot for you, you can obviously take that quarter zip off, wrap it around the waist or ditch it entirely, and it still works really well. For outfit number two, we're starting in white jeans as we do so often. Then we've got a pair of Converse in medium blue. These are canvas. An absolutely incredible spring staple for many different looks, including this one, I think. So we've got another shirt from The Gap, really nice and breathable, a plaid shirt. And then on top of that, from Outer Known, we've got a shirt jacket. Tying that back in with a necklace that has a little bit of blue and then this beautiful Louis Vuitton watch in dark and light blue. We're talking about spring layering today and shirt jackets are an absolutely amazing piece for that. For outfit number three, we're in shorts, the first short look for this year. These are from Zara, and so is this white and yellow striped shirt. Then on my feet, we've got the Ankari Flores white sneakers that need a little bit of cleaning. Don't worry, I'll get to it eventually. And then to finish that look off, we've got from Goodfellow, the Target brand, a knitted utility jacket up top, another great layering piece, really nice summer colors, and then picking that up with these Ryan shades in metal and brown, as well as a Piaget watch, and then a fun little multi-material bracelet from Serge Denim for a really nice spring look. Um, I was hesitant to combine the yellow with the faded pink, but I think it worked really well in the end. For outfit number four, we've got another pair of Uniqlo chinos, ultra stretchy, like incredibly comfortable. And then a short sleeve shirt from Abercrombie and yet again, a pair of high top canvas Converse um, in white this time. To finish that look off, we've got a denim jacket from Levi's that I actually custom made. You'll see what it says on the back in just a second. And then from Ray-Ban, we've got these brown shades. We've got from Longines, a brown leather strap watch and then a little beaded bracelet once again to pick up on the colors. And now you can see it, good vibes. Absolutely love this jacket for that alone. A nice summery look, easy layering with a denim jacket. For outfit number five, we're starting out in Goodfellow jeans in black. So once again from Target. Then we've got a cardigan or shirt, like a knit shirt from Zara in black. We've got black Doc Martens. You can easily swap these out for black sneakers if you don't want to do boots in the spring or the summer. And then right here we have a piece from Seasons. Seasons is an incredible platform where you can rent designer pieces for a monthly fee. So this beautiful Prada vest I got via Seasons. You get to hold on to it for a month. And if you love it, you can buy it. If you don't, you return it. And I think that's an incredible, sustainable way to start dressing up in more designer clothes again. So for this outfit, all black. I really like the vest. It's just a nice little highlight, but we need a bit more. We've got from Girard Perigo a watch. And then from Dior, we have these black frames that have seen better days in the past. But I really like this look. A bit edgy, but like nice and clean lines. Um, just solid. For Saturday, we've got outfit number six, a pair of ripped Zara jeans, then from Goodfellow, yet again at Target, a long sleeve with a pocket. I love their essentials. Then we've got from Dior, these beautiful kicks in white and black. You're obviously seeing which color scheme I'm going for here. And then this amazing cardigan from Zara in cream with some black detailing. Really like this. And then I decided to add some black specks as well as this necklace, a Mont Blanc watch, and a little bracelet from Vitaly for an overall really chill, like almost collegiate type vibe that I think is really, really dope. Took me a second to get back into cardigans, but this one really, really did it for me. Last but not least, we're finishing off in these ultra wide jeans from Zara in a tan color, really nice faded tan. We've got AF1s in pure white, low tops. And then up top, we've got a striped Oxford from The Gap. And on top of that, we've got a V-neck sweater vest from Zara in a gray jersey cotton like it looks really nice i didn't know that i was gonna love it as much as i did when i bought it we've got specs from jade black we've got the piaget polo s yet again and then from Hermes, this nice little cuff on the right side really minimal a little bit preppy but obviously because that silhouette is so accentuated 
we've got a whole lot going on with this look. I actually really, really like this for a nice Sunday brunch type vibe. That's it for today. Thank you guys so, so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Leave your comments, thoughts, questions down below, and I'll see you guys soon with the next video. Until then, stay dapper. Bye.